inaugurated today, Republican Dennis Richardson. He was sworn in as Oregon's next Secretary of State. And it was a big deal. He's the first Republican to fill that position in 32 years. Our Tim Becker was at this morning's ceremony and has more now from the newsroom. During his inauguration speech, Dennis Richardson promised to work as an Oregonian rather than as a Republican or Democrat. He's promising greater accountability and transparency into public records and government spending. But that's also why some question his choice for Deputy Secretary of State. Secretary of State. Of the Office of Secretary of State. According to the best of my ability. According to the best of my ability. Congratulations. For the first time since 1985, a Republican is sworn in as Oregon's Secretary of State. Supporters say Dennis Richardson will help stop the state's budget from bleeding. Well, he's going to make sure that every dollar is used appropriately to fulfill the needs of the voters and the citizens of the state. And it's my commitment that you will not know whether I have an R or a D behind my name. Richardson won last month's election by five percentage points over Democratic nominee Brad Avakian. As Secretary of State, Richardson will be the first Republican in decades to oversee Oregon elections and audit public agencies. So I think you're going to see like some education audits out of him and performance audits of our schools. Um, we can't just keep throwing money at education without actually understanding where it's going and why it's not getting to the classroom. But promises of ultra transparency and increased accountability are also why some questions in Richardson's choice of Leslie Cummings for Deputy Secretary of State. Cummings was a manager at the Oregon Employment Department when this 2012 audit report revealed multiple project delays and overspending. Richardson's communications director tells me Cummings was never directly tied to the mismanagement. Really how she tried to sound the alarms about the dysfunction within state government. And that's one of the main reasons Dennis actually hired Leslie. Leslie Cummings resigned from the employment department a year after that report came out. Richardson says he plans to use her uh, for what he calls her understanding of dysfunction in Salem to help change it. Back to you guys.